Okay, hey y'all. We are going to do another synthetic division problem. Okay, so say if our problem, whoop, nope. Say, let me go ahead and write this synthetic. Synthetic division. Say for our problem, they tell us to divide x to the fifth, a positive x cubed, and a negative 2 all over x minus 1. Okay, so ooh, um, notice here that we actually can't use any exponent rules. Uh, there would be no way to simply divide x fifth x to the fifth divided by x or x cubed divided by x um, and the reason being it's not strictly multiplication up top and in the bottom uh, what I have here is addition subtraction because of those operation signs that needs to be your first clue that uh, simply reducing is not really an option um, another thing we need to notice here is that my exponents um, while they are in descending order there are missing terms, there are missing exponents. And so we actually need to account for those. I would have x to the fifth. What you do is we're just gonna add a zero, x to the fourth. I actually do have a cubed. I do not have a squared. And then um, I also do not have to the first power, do have that constant right there at the end. And then right there, I have my x minus 1. Okay, so these are going to be the um, – uh, sorry, it's like my mind went blank all of a sudden. <laughs> these are going to be the, like the coefficients that I pull down to do my synthetic division. And let me – I'm just going to cover that part up right there. So I'm looking at the right-hand side. And what I would do is I have a 1, I have a 0, I have a 1, 0, 0, negative 2. I'm going to do the same thing I've been doing, putting my bottom right box under my farthest right term. And then um, I notice that because it's telling me I'm dividing by x minus 1, if you set that equal to 0, what you actually get is a 1. I know I need to bring this down past my line. And what I do here is 1 times 1 is 1. The combination of 0 and 1 is 1. 1 times 1 is 1. The combination of 1 and 1 is 2. 1 times 2 is 2. The combination of 0 and 2 is 2. 1 times 2 is 2. The combination of 0 and 2 is 2. 1 times 2 is 2. The combination of 2 and negative 2 gives me 0. So the actual answer, the quotient to this synthetic division problem, um, I know that I'm going to write the numbers that I have uh, computed right down here at the bottom. And what I do is I actually look at the individual variables and exponents and when I write the answer those will go down by an exponent. I'm touching the screen but it's not letting me do anything. Um, in case something freezes the answer would be x to the fourth plus x cubed plus a 2x squared plus 2x plus 2. Still trying here I have pretty much okay so I could still move like this and it will not let me write so it may have happened who knows how it happened um, let me say that again I know that my coefficients to my variables are one one two 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 and my actual variables and exponents will go in the order of x to the fourth x cubed, um, x squared, and then x. My final, whoa, there we go. Don't know what happened, y'all. So looking at these right here and putting those variables with one less exponent, 
I get x to the fourth. I got a positive x cubed. I get a positive 2x squared. I get a positive 2x. And then lastly, I get a positive 2. So it's very important if you forget to add that term, this term, or this term, your answer will definitely not be close to this, okay? If y'all have any questions, make sure y'all let me know, okay? Thanks. Bye.